Hi guys, it's Thursday, it's tea time. I'm having a quick walk around Bonnie Street Market. The stall at the front is open, so I assume the whole market was open, but it looks like it's closed. I'm honestly not sure of the close because of time of day. It's about half four now, so it probably is past closing time for the market. They close, don't know what time they close. Is it half three or something? I mean, the whole market's going to be closing anyway, which for me is really sad. I'm looking forward to the new development for sure, but I am really super duper sad for the market. What I'm hoping for is I'm hoping that they'll get some kind of alternate accommodations offered, some kind of reprieve or they'll just get offered a different site or even an indoor site. I'm sure that there is somewhere where this market could go so it just doesn't have to close I just really like to see it move somewhere else because practically every single Blackpool local has walked around Bonnie Street Market at some point in their lives you'd be very hard pressed to find a local that hasn't been around the market I mean, when I was younger, when my kids were little, we used to do car boot sales here in the winter because the market used to close for the winter and we could rent the stalls out for something like £8 a day and do a car boot here and that was great fun. Some of the stalls you couldn't rent out because they were like covered up and they were like permanent stalls that had the stall holders permanent stocking but some of them they were rentable a lot of them back then were like this if you look at this one here that's like more outdoorsy looking a lot of them were like that and they had like table big things of tabley wood across them and these little shelters on them and they were the ones that we rented out at the time but I'm going back now oh a good few years probably 25 years or so so yeah I've actually worked on the market for a day in a stall albeit my own car boot stall for a few days and a few times I mean, I've never had an official stall and that is back to the front again you can see the tower up there and that is the front stall where the toys are but there are some people around there so I'm not going to film the people who are just browsing I'm going to turn the camera back around here and I'm going to say thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed this quick little video because I have been asked to film the market so I do hope you like it and I will see you all soon in the next video goodbye Hi guys, I've just finished my Bonnie Street Market video as you will have guessed because I'm planning on putting this little bit of footage straight after the Bonnie Street video so yeah, I know I just said goodbye on that but I'm right back again because when I'd finished Bonnie Street Market filming I just spoke to the dude on the toy store in the entrance and I asked him, I said are oh, the other stores still open? you know after they just closed because of the day and he said yeah they're still open they're open from 9am and they closed pretty early afternoon but the market the whole market is closing for good on Sunday that's what the well almost the whole market the toy store guy in the front and the little perfume store next to him they're doing an extra couple of weekends he told me but apart from that yeah the whole market is closing at the end of the week that's really sad and they haven't been offered any alternative 
sites or accommodations or anything. So I don't know, hopefully, like the, the toy store dude said when I spoke to him, hopefully everybody will just find something better to do and it might work out better and they might make more money and everything might work out great. So let's hope for that, eh? So, yeah, goodbye Bonnie Street Market, it's the end of an era and it is closing this Sunday. But yeah, but it's really sad. I mean, I am looking forward to the new development. It's going to be epic. But like I said earlier, I am sad for the market.